Hey guys, so I'm about to go to the mall. Do you want to know why? It's really ridiculous. So at 22 years old, my body decided to change and like grow, like my boobs grew. Like I haven't been wearing my bras because my boobs grew, so they don't fit in my bra. So I've been braless for like a long time. Like during Blood Queens filming, I was not wearing any bras and everyone was like noticing. So low key embarrassed, gonna go to the mall with Ken Ken. We're gonna meet up with our friends. I had no idea, like at 22 years old, why my boobs decided to grow two cup sizes. Everyone thought I got a boob job. So yeah, I feel like a 12 year old all over again, I'm about to go bra shopping. So those of you who are flat chested and you're younger, there's still hope for you, bless. I'm 22 years old and my boobs just grew two cup sizes. On another note, you guys know that Makeup Plus app that I always use for my Instagram selfies that I've showed you in vlogs before, where like it's it's like you could put like a filter on your face, kind of like a Snapchat filter, and it has like makeup presets. I've showed you with like Paris Hilton's looks, I've showed you with like Nikki Tutorials, I've showed you with like a bunch of different looks. Guess what? I'm gonna have my own looks on the Makeup Plus app, so you get to choose from like three of my looks. Um, I'm gonna show you an example after I'm done explaining, but like pretty much if you don't know what Makeup Plus is, you could have no makeup on, or if your makeup looks crappy in a selfie that you like, you could like fix it on this app. It's so cool. And I'm gonna have three looks. They're gonna be called Rosiella, Wannabella, and Fanciella. Rosiella is like a rose gold. Wannabella is like my traditional winged eyeliner. I'm kind of like poking fun at how people call me like Wannabella or like an Ariana Grande wannabe. Then the fourth preset is Fancy Ella. It's a completely fancy makeup look. I'm gonna show you guys after I'm done explaining like a little sneak peek of like my makeup presets. I'm gonna show you me playing around with the AR Glam, which is a new feature. So this is the Makeup Plus app, but um, this is AR Glam. Here, I'm just gonna show you real quick. These are so fun. This is so cute. I'm a mouse, duh. I could just take a picture of myself and edit any kind of like makeup on it. You can choose whatever you want. You could go to collections and I'm gonna have a collection on this app so you could use one of my makeup presets. There's like Daniel Chinchilla which is uh, Ariana's makeup artist, there's Nikki Tutorials, there's Akasha Brindley. This is one of my looks called Rosiella. It's like a rose gold look. And then I have this look. This is my winged eyeliner look. This is called Wannabella. So these are all makeup filters you guys are gonna be able to apply to your faces to get my makeup look. So these are the bras that I'm getting. I'm gonna do like a little haul right now. So my friend Edelie's helping me. <laughs> So I'm getting this cute pink one. I told the girl anything like pink and foofy. She's like, I watch your videos. Like I'm getting this like sexy red one. <laughs> I'm getting this pastel pink one. And I'm getting this nude one that's like, has a little bit of a push up to it. It's sure. kind of like blush too. Yeah, yeah make sure I strip the side. <laughs> I'm gonna post on my snap story. <laughs> Why is this not focusing? I swear it says 32C, there we go. I got a bunch of those bras I showed you. I'm not gonna do another little haul, but then I went to Sephora and I got my favorite foundation ever. I got super dark color and like a medium yellowy color because my skin color adjusts in the summer and I need to mix them, but yeah, it's my favorite foundation ever from Clinique. I also had a lot of VIB points, so I got this box because it has a bunch of like anti-aging serums and skin firming things and even though I don't need it, I love putting anti-aging things on my face before I do my makeup because it like really tightens it. Then I got a Glam Glow face mask because they're just amazing. Oh my god, I'm gonna put one on tonight. <laughs> And then I got this like really, really cute rose gold powder from Makeup Forever. It's called Starlet Powder. If it would just focus, that would be great. It's not focusing. And then in Bath and Body Works, I got like a crap ton of Endless Weekend Wallflowers because that is the scent that I use all over my apartment and smells so good all over my apartment. Hey guys, so I'm currently in the car right now on the way to the foot doctor. He's spending his day off from work to take me to the doctor. He's a very good boyfriend. So, this is like a mini story time. I'm gonna tell you what happened like at the Blood Queen's cast party. It was pretty much, we were swimming in the river and there's a rope swing and it's so fun. Well, not fun anymore. I always jump from the rope swing. The rope swing is like my shit. It's so fun. 
and I do it with Colin all the time. But we came back to the rope swing this summer and there's a second one next to it. So I'm like, Colin, let's you, like be Tarzan and jump from rope to rope. So Colin was able to do it very successfully. And then I was like, hey Colin, I can do it too. I was trying to make him all proud. I was trying to impress everyone. I went to go do it. I did grab the other rope, but then when it was time for me to jump onto the other rope, the tree, it was, it was either I jump in on the rocks, like the shallow end or the tree, like it was way too late to jump. So I jumped down on the rocks and I might have broke my foot again. The same foot I broke in the beginning of Nikki and Gabby in like 2013, 2014. Drop! <laughs> oh, 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 oh shit! Yeah. Are you okay? No. No. Go! 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 See, I'm wearing my boot again because it hurts really bad. I'm gonna insert a picture right now of what my foot looks like. It was just the most like epic rope swing fail ever. It just sucks. Take a look at your foot. So you were on a rope swing and fell. Yeah. You did. Oh gosh. Mm -hmm. Can you even imagine how much that hurt? I know. Oh. So. I have like a video of it and everything because I was expecting it to be like successful. Oh. But <laughs> it was like not <laughs> successful. Not, oh, that's terrible. Poor thing. Should yeah, I take? If you don't mind taking off your boot, yeah, I'll take a look at it. Yeah. Okay. I think you got. I think you may have um, done a, a uh, what more like a stress fracture here. There were rocks everywhere and I I was like it was either the tree or the rocks oh, so oh my gosh yeah you're gonna get more black and blue you're probably gonna get a streaking of yellow up the leg you may it's gonna look lovely before it heals completely it's probably gonna take a good it might take up to six weeks for it to feel better should I wear the boots still for wear six the boots I would wear the boot at least for three weeks I have a heel that's like a uh, you know something <laughs> yeah, like something to support the guy, like a yeah. heel boot. Um, yes, that might be better. Willable. I think by then you'll probably feel like you won't be able to wear it for a whole day like uh -huh. you're normally able to, but yeah. you'll be able to do it for a little while. Fractured right in here. See how this is like sort of sy symmetrical in mm -hmm. a way, and there's like some changes in yeah. here. And it's right where you have the most pain, so. Yep. Fracture. Oh, that's from my old fracture. <laughs> yeah, yeah. That's crazy. Oh my. I know. That yeah. was bad. That my was foot a horrible one. Half. So right here looks pretty normal, huh? Yeah. Well, look at that. Look at that. I'm gonna be rocking a boot. Oh well, when life gives you lemons, you make lemonade. I'm gonna rock this boot. 